Hello, it's Terry here. Reasons why real estate is a good investment in the long term. So you've save up a bit per bit of your salary each payday, watching it grow like a garden of money. You've worked hard year after year and you're starting feel your back hurt. Suddenly you decide to invest in an asset that would be great not just in one to two years but the long game. This is important for you because you realize that you're no terminator machine that can work for the rest of your life. You know deep down that you can't work forever. You did some research and spent long hours after work searching about the topic. After your research, you found out that Arnold Schwarzenegger was already a self-made millionaire at 22 years old, thanks to his investments in real estate. Other examples of real estate as being a good investment is from Barbara Corcoran, founder of the Corcoran Group, podcast host of Business Unusual, Judge on Shark Tank. She famously said buying real estate has made me rich, mostly through necessity, not by design. I bought my first Adu Bitty studio after scraping together a few bucks because I needed to live somewhere anyway. A few years later, the studio doubled in value, giving me enough cash to plunk down 50% on a one-bedroom apartment. That soon rolled into a two-bedroom, then a three-bedroom, and finally landed me in my 10-room penthouse on 5th Avenue in New York City. Buying that tiny studio was the most important decision I made because it got me in the game, Barbara said. What advantages does investing in real estate give you in the long run? Real estate gains are deferrable. Our tax code, under a 1031 exchange, permits the gain on the sale of an investment property to be transferred from the property being sold to a new property being purchased, hence deferring the payment of any tax on the sale of the property. Avail deductions and tax breaks. Once you become a real estate investor you can avail certain tax breaks and deductions, which saves you money and tax time. Normally, you can deduct the cost of owning, operating, and managing a real estate property. Real estate can be leveraged. The most important advantage of real estate investing is leverage. It is the use of borrowed capital to increase the potential return of an investment. In real estate transactions, leverage occurs when a mortgage is used to reduce the amount of investor capital required to purchase a property. The annual return on a $200,000 property with a $20,000 net cash flow purchased with cash is 10%. Now, let's assume a loan of $150,000 is amortized over 30 years at 5% interest, but 75% of the money required to purchase the property is borrowed, even factoring in the cost of making the mortgage payment, the annual return more than doubles to 22%. Once you have built up an equity position in an investment property, you can leverage that investment for cash in one of two ways, secure a second loan against the increased equity or refinance the original loan amount plus the increased equity. This frees up money to buy another investment property. Equity Each time you make a mortgage payment a part of it goes toward paying interest on the loan and a part goes toward paying down the principal value of the property. With each payment, you own more and more of the property. If you own rental properties and have properly purchased a good investment, the income from the rentals will pay the mortgage payment, and there will be leftover money for repairs, maintenance, and more. At the end of the mortgage period, you will own the entire property, and your tenants will have paid for the majority of the cost. Real estate coincides with retirement. When real estate is purchased, the cash flow is lower and the principal reduction on the mortgage is less. Over time the mortgage is paid down, or paid off, and the cash flow increases. In some respects it's a forced savings program, yielding a greater amount as time goes by which is a perfect investment for retirement as it increases in cash flow down the road. Inflation Hedge Advantage as economies grows, the demand and need for real estate drives rents higher each certain period. This turns into higher capital value. We need to understand that real estate tends to maintain the buying power of capital because it passes some of the inflation pressure to the tenants, those who pay you to live in your property. Real estate also maintains its buying power by incorporating some of the inflation pressure in the form of capital appreciation. Diversification leads to increased stability. Many investors strive to reduce the overall risk of their portfolio by allocating funds to various types of assets and securities. A good investment advisor will tell you the fundamental component of investment risk reduction is asset class diversification, or put more simply, not putting all your eggs in one basket. This variation of assets helps to ensure that a portion of your investment portfolio is performing well at all times, increasing the overall value of your portfolio at any given point in a fluctuating economic cycle. Adding investment real estate to your portfolio will help offset the volatility of other high-risk assets, thereby reducing the overall risk level of your portfolio, and providing you with steadier returns. Income 
The first point is that real estate can help create a stream of income. I'm sure most of you are familiar with the concept of paying rent. I own several multifamily buildings. Each one of the units is creating an income stream from the current tenants. They pay rent each month, and that monthly income flows to the owner. In this case, it's me, but it could be you. The reason I think this point is so crucial is because of what it represents in the long term. Most people are focused on saving for retirement. But what does that mean, fundamentally? It means that you are trying to save up enough money so one day you can replace your current income from your job, and then stop working. Real estate appreciates in value. Since 1968, appreciation levels for real estate have been 6% per year, including during the downturn in the economy beginning in 2007, according to the National Association of Realtors. Cash Flow Cash flow is the net income from a real estate investment after mortgage payments and operating expenses have been made. A key benefit of real estate investing is its ability to generate cash flow. In many cases, cash flow only strengthens over time as you pay down your mortgage, and build up your equity. A key benefit of real estate investing is its ability to generate cash flow. In most cases, cash flow strengthens over time as you pay your mortgage as time passes by. This builds up your equity. You need to remember that cash flow is the net income after paying the mortgage and operating expenses, insurance, yearly maintenance and act. Real estate is depreciable. Depreciation is a non-cash expense permitted by tax code that depreciates the value of your investment property over time. However, the value of your investment property actually appreciates. The depreciation deduction allows a real estate investor to generate larger positive cash flow while reporting a lower income for tax purposes. This creates a higher return than you may initially realize. Real estate is improvable. One of the most unique and attractive advantages of real estate is that it is improvable. Because real estate is a tangible asset made of wood, brick, concrete, and glass you can improve the value of any property with some elbow grease and sweat equity. Whether the repairs are structural or cosmetic, do it yourself or hire someone, the principle is the same. You can make your real estate worth more by improving it. But Terry I don't know where to start. If you're having other questions about what to buy, how to buy, how to get your house insured, if a house has a good price based on market value, then call us now at 1-612-418-2940.